Spirit Airlines literally almost turned me into a spirit. <laughs> awkward so many people hey guys so awkward you know what? i don't care hey guys welcome back to my channel so in today's well if you're new i'm mariette but you can call me mimi um so yeah we are going to Hey guys, so Attention customers, effective immediately, curbside Why should wait until I started talking? I don't know But hey guys, so we just arrived at the airport in Dallas um, We're currently waiting on our friend Stephanie to get here And then we're going to head to the Airbnb I think, so So yeah and then we got Chick-fil-A. I need to stop eating Chick-fil-A because I eat this like every week and I need to stop. But I'll update you guys for an hour. That's not bad. Considering how in Orlando, they tried to make us pay. In Orlando, they tried to make us pay $75 to Uber from my brother's house to the airport. Which was like a 15, 20 minute drive. Which was like 15 minutes. But here, the Airbnb is like an hour away and it's only $40. Mm -mm -mm. That's crazy. But I'm gonna hit you guys up later. Did y'all see the buns of steel? Y'all see it or not? It said hi. Yeah. Look at that, it's supposed to be gone. Purr, you know I gotta flex. Oh, Let me stop. Nice. stall and it's so intimate and dark like there's no light it's just intimate like it's nice oh, aesthetic here yeah. per prop my camera up right here hey guys look at my skin I have Stephanie with me. Hi guys. So we we made it into our um Airbnb. Yeah, I was gonna say. Um, it looks really nice. I should do a tour and give it get, and show you guys what it looks like. Uh huh. Uh huh. And the view, it's a view. It's something. <laughs> it's a something. It's, it's 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 something. You know, very much something. It's a lot of pavement. Something. Very much something. No, I want to be back in the sun because I like. Yo, what if you want to witness a murder popping? Hello. I'm gonna say. Here's me. I'm gonna say police. Papa, English. No speaking English. As soon as I see the murder, and I when I see it, I'm like, just now, just now, and then look my way. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I'm gonna murder you. 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 Yo, I'm gonna here comes the sun. Doo -doo -doo -doo. I should give you guys a tour. Let me do that. I'm gonna give you guys a tour. <laughs> All right, guys. So when you first come in, here's the little kitchen area. We got a little fridge, you know. It's not stocked, but that's okay. We got a we got a knife set. We got some salt and pepper. You know, a whole kitchen and stuff. And then here's the little living room. 
you know okay and then here's the view you know it ain't bad i mean it's a view you know it ain't given everything but it's still a view at the end of the day you know so let's continue so right here we have a half bath can y'all see yeah uh, with the full body mirror in the back and then you know toilet let's close that and then over here we have the bedroom everybody done claimed their spots and in here we have the bathroom there's the closet washer and dryer oh yeah we're on the 11th floor here's me the mirror here's a little shower oh it has the overhead shower and then here's the toilet is there a closet oh we just walked in there. It. We just walked in there. Here's this little... Is that an eye? Yeah. That ain't sitting right with me. Because who's watching us? I want to go to the rooftop. I want to go to the rooftop, too. Well, Let's go. go downstairs. To so, yes. I'm going to be in the sun because I like how, how I look in the sun. But, yeah, guys. So, that's the room. Um, Are we going to the rooftop right now? So, we have to go get a wristband. Because we can't get into the rooftop if we don't have a wristband. So, that's what we're about to go do right now. And then, I'm going to show you guys when we get to the rooftop. The rooftop. The rooftop. Yeah. The rooftop. Yeah. The rooftop. Yeah. Yeah. Are you going bowling? I want to go bowling. You want to go bowling? I want to go bowling. My AirPods are dead. Um, cause I'm not gonna use them. Not that much. I mean, I can charge them whenever. But yeah. All right, guys. I'm gonna I'm gonna holla at you when we get to whatever we're doing next. If that's the rooftop, I feel like they left me. Or if we're going to dinner or walking around town, I don't know. But I'll see you guys at the next step. Hey guys. So we're oh. So okay, so we're currently. Oh, I don't like how this looks. We're currently walking downtown, just scoping out the area. So. Me and Stephanie are playing tic I almost said tic tac toe three in a row. We're playing connect four right now. She just beat me, but it's okay because I'm gonna win this next round. That's right. I'm gonna win this next round. That's I right. claim it. <laughs> I wish I had my tripod. It's okay. Stephanie is a cheater. How? Because I ran out of the black ones and then she took the white ones and filled them to make it seem like she got all four. She cheated, bro. But I won you cheated. You cheated. But I won no, you didn't. You cheated. But and then look at this wasp. Just why? Why are you here? Even the wasp was killing you. Wow. Even the wasp was killing you. I feel disrespected. I feel hurt. I it's whatever. Stephanie's gonna try to kill the wasp. Was Tell no, you. You wanted to come after you? The wasp is big chilling, bro. It's weird, you know. No. <laughs> the wasp the is unbothered, okay? It's living its best life. It's still chilling. Just let it go. Let it go.
final winner i don't remember how many points i had so humble so humble you know sometimes you just have to celebrate yourself you know and i just really feel like that's what i'm gonna do right now so i'm gonna do that you but right now we're gonna i'm i'm in the search for food and i drag stephanie along with me so because i can't be by myself we're in a whole nother state I don't mind if myself. <laughs> it's nighttime though these people are crazy they be sex trafficking and everything not in my hometown <laughs> But we're gonna go get food, so. Alright guys, so we ended up finding this pizza place and I got wings, so. I'm about to eat and call it a night. So, I'll see you guys in the morning. Very tall building that allows you to oversee the 
entire city of Dallas. So I'm gonna show you guys that and then I'm gonna show you guys a little bit of Clyde Park while we're here. But guys, I'm literally so hot and tired because I just wanna take a nap, but you know, it's okay. It's okay. Yeah, we're gonna get through it, but yeah. This is not UF's campus, but the reunion tower. So, yeah, it's pretty nice. But we're gonna wait until a sunset hits. So.
back at the exchange and then um we just got food i got tacos because that's my favorite food and then stephanie got chicken stir fry yeah she's tearing it up but um and then i also got a side of fries but i'm waiting for my sister to come and give her food so yeah i'm gonna eat I'm gonna eat right now. You know, the food gotta eat first, but I'm gonna eat. I sacrificed enough today. <laughs> like the tortillas are made by tortillas. Tortillers. Tortillers. I don't know how to pronounce it. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? So, guys, I got my tacos. There's a mukbang. I don't know what kind of sauce this is. It's not red and it's not. something in the morning we are going to church i got my lemon pepper steppers on <laughs> or devil steppers if y'all want to um huh what So yeah, we're about to go to Social Dallas. Hopefully, you know, the Maverick City people are there. Uh, I mean, um, what's his face? Chandler Moore goes to that church. God, you know, if the Maverick City people could lead worship, that would be really nice. Uh, <laughs> Thank you in advance. But yes, guys, this is the fit. And then I got my orange purse. Which I've been wearing with every outfit. You know what it reminds me of? Of um, when Young Miami was telling Santana, that purse crying. Because he kept wearing it over and over. What happened? Oh, God. It's that same Chanel bag. What a bomb, man. It's home. I'm sick of it. I'm sick of you. That purse crying to get put in there. <laughs> that purse crying to get put down. That car. That <laughs> but it's okay though, because I make it look good. Period. Let me show you. I don't know if that's see if it fit this way. But let me show you. Yeah. You have to pull your dress down. Ma'am, let me be. The saints are coming after me. Oh my gosh. to head to the museum right now which is literally across the street from the park but we stopped here to get like food and stuff like a little bit like something to snack on i don't know if we're actually getting anything just to, like wait out the time for when the museum actually opens which should be in like two minutes but i don't know if we're gonna actually get anything i think we're probably just gonna head over so yeah but church was good um god came for my neck um i think he came for everybody neck but like to the point where I was I, I, I was crying in church, but it's fine, you know, but it was a good service. Um, so, yeah, uh, we're going to go to the museum. So I'm going to show you guys that and then I'll check in with you guys later because we're doing a lot today. So we're going to the museum, a farmer's market um, dinner. We're dressing up real cute. 
um and we're going to go see other things as well so stay tuned okay period BTS behind the shoe. <laughs> BTS angles, angles. Yes, yes. You better. You see her? Y'all see my dog? Angles. <laughs> For brunch, um, they didn't give us any menus yet, though. We're just gonna wait it out. Don't look at me. I'm the live audience. Guys, Stephanie's gonna try a blackberry for the first time. Blackberry, no phone. That's a cancer. She said blackberry, no phone. It doesn't look like cancer. It's good. Try it. Five, four, three, two, one. It's not bad. See? Can I get a straw from here? Thank you. Pretty good. <laughs> hey guys, I'm with Stephanie. Hi, I'm with my sister. We're currently going to the farmer's market. We just ate and it was too good. And we got the bill. Her. <laughs> but yeah, right now we're walking to the farmer's market. And I'm gonna show y'all because we're right here. We understand each other. So, yeah. The baby chickens. We got a big chicken. Chestnut. Oh, 
mushroom. Girl, I thought that was bread. Oh, I was like, that's a fat mushroom. I didn't know the shrooms come that big. Hey guys, so we made it back from the farmer's market probably like an hour ago. So we got some things. You know, supporting black businesses. <laughs> what is this? This is a daily moisturizer. My sister got this. Um, It's like an organic shea butter um, thingy. It smells pretty good. And it's whipped really nicely. And then we also got this hair balm and it has lavender and rosemary in it i can't really smell it which is kind of crazy but yeah he said it's good for growing your hair and stuff and it's made with organic products and they don't have all those chemicals and alcohol stuff in it so we're gonna be trying it out and stuff so yeah but the farmer's market was really nice um yeah it was really nice and there was a lot of vendors and a lot of like different things to try food clothes jewelry skincare products organic juices just a whole bunch of stuff so it was really nice so if you're ever in dallas go check it out because it's really nice but so right now we're about to well in a little bit we're about to start getting ready to go to dinner um is we're going to this restaurant called kiss dallas um and it's supposed to be like a bougie restaurant there is a dress well pretty much everywhere here there's a dress code enforced um my arm is getting tired but yeah we're about to get ready and stuff like that um and we're gonna see what it's about and i'm gonna show you guys um, everything, so stay tuned. <laughs> stuff in the back i can't even zoom in oh well but hey guys <laughs> hey guys um so it is monday morning we're actually about to leave um we're waiting on our lyft or uber and we're heading to the airport and we're going back to florida no. ghetto florida no, <laughs> no for real ghetto florida you know texas was fun dallas was fun i enjoyed my time here last night was actually fun this one here what happened <laughs> this one here enjoyed herself a little too much Like, there's 
no other experience. God made me black and I love it. Wait, is this Drake? I had nothing to do with it. I cut myself off. I had nothing to do with it. I knew my limitations. I was aware. <laughs> yeah. Um. I don't know if I'm going to end the vlog here. But if I do, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoy it. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in my next video. Peace. Hey, guys. Um, so it's currently like a couple of days later after the trip and you know back home um, But I wanted to come on here and close out the vlog like I know I Tried to close out the vlog already. I don't know if I'm gonna insert that clip if I do Then you guys will know I did try to um close out the vlog but I wanted to come on here and I don't know just tell you guys like just to close out the vlog and actually tell you guys what happened on the way back like literally y'all uh, Spirit Airlines literally almost turned me into a spirit the ride back to Florida was so crazy literally like we encountered so much turbulence to the point where like the plane was shaking and like to the point where like the plane even dipped a little bit like it got to the point where i got scared like i, I legit just started praying legit just started praying was like god please let us land safely and stuff like that because y'all it was crazy okay like everybody on the plane was like oh my gosh like you know and not even that but like before we even before the plane even took off like we were on the the little plane runway thing i guess it's called like a tamarack or something like that i don't know but we were on that little runway for like about an hour because we couldn't take off because apparently it was raining and we had to wait until the rain was over before we took off into the air and baby the way up into the air it was just so much turbulence like it was just so much shaking and it was just crazy i should have known it was gonna get crazy when um the pilot came on the little overhead speaker and was like because it was time for the flight attendants to you know go down the little walkway thing and pass out like drinks and snacks and stuff like that if people wanted to purchase that i should have known it was about to get crazy once he said flight attendants please do not move sit down and just stay seated because we are about to experience some turbulence boy as soon as he said that mm, the plane the plane oh my gosh it was just it was just horrible i was like oh like it was just so bad but yeah and not only that y'all but like we were in the back of the plane like the very last row of the plane so there was no windows i was already feeling anxious from that because like we're in the back of a plane there's no windows we couldn't see and like there was a window like connected to the row in front of us and i kept trying to like scoot up and trying to look out the window and see um and see what was happening and stuff but the girl who was sitting next to the window she was taking a nap so like it got to the point she was blocking the windows so i couldn't see so i was already dealing with some anxiety from that not being able to see anything but that flight baby i'm back on and up by your glove but but after i prayed to god and was like you know please let us live safely like i was legit like declare like in jesus name we gonna live safe in jesus name this plane is gonna land safe like i was legit declaring you know like but after i got done praying i felt fine like we still was encountering turbulence and stuff like that and the plane was still shaking but i felt fine like i was just like i'm fine we're gonna make it like i already prayed god already settled me like i have peace like i have faith we're going to land safely and we did y'all but yeah i just wanted to I say that because it was a little crazy you know um but yeah we made it safely so yeah <laughs> i just wanted to talk about that but yeah with that being said you know um spirit airlines i don't know baby i'm not gonna say i'm not gonna fly you guys again because like it's turbulence like planes encounter turbulence you know but i don't know we'll see 
um it was an interesting experience i'll say that for sure but i did enjoy my time in dallas i miss it so much i want to go back florida is just ghetto um but yeah i really enjoyed my time and i had so much fun and i hope you guys saw that throughout the vlog so yeah my weightlifting class is about to start in a little bit so i'm gonna head out but i just want to say thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this vlog i hope that i don't know i hope it encouraged you to want to travel and go to dallas child i don't know but thank you guys so much for watching please leave a like comment and subscribe and i'll see you in my next video god willing okay period bye y'all <laughs>